Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This video I am gonna be touring you through maybe even three hour long adventure of how Slovenian police managed to intercept yet another item damaged me further uh, with idea to bring me to stop to complete stop basically this crime alone is if you ask me this is a fucking atrocity already this this one I'm gonna spoke about tonight this is this is already mech daddy of crimes right here I'm gonna be talking about this is the crime in which not only Slovenian police a local heroes therefore as I refer to them as and in which previous video I already have discussed how these local heroes were even selling became a sellers of customized watches on a eBay through first what was first they used the local watch repairman yeah it was first the local watch repairman then what they did was they tried out other channels because they fought trap they learned that people learned about their selling watches modified watches literally through this watch repairman whose customers became recommended through London where it is about exactly the same people once they smelled about set up they used other sources to push uh, then it was most of them stopped but it was one or two individuals they continue to push the sales use this business which they learned literally to destruction of my private property as an afternoon extra work if you like okay so in this video be prepared this is possibly even three hour long video but in this video what I do is I expose how the police therefore local Slovenian police attempted to literally bring me to complete stop and uh, when I say complete stop I have in mind as I stated earlier a hard drive which at a time only had like an 18 gigabyte hard drive left uh, recalling this hard drive never was delivered again just like other merchandise which I ordered from Aliexpress or eBay a lot of merchandise never arrived it was stolen much of the merchandise was stolen but this is a, such a big item uh, in a value of like 20 euros that Slovenian police could not steal this item they were not capable to uh, to steal this item however it was exactly this item uh, that it was used for the Slovenian businesses to earn money to earn cash uh, it was a business potential literally which they enforced straight through the through this case beginning already sometimes in 2013 so if you're not for three hour crime I'm gonna also at the end uh, I don't know if I'm gonna play you this audio here this was the uh, the local delivery company which was supposed to deliver the item this item however should uh, been delivered from france to slovenia by dpd dpd has a seat literally established by germans the company has a, a seat a headquarters in a paris in france however in slovenia we have a branch yeah so this is I'm gonna say Slovenian police used on behalf of Belgrade on behalf of Moscow 
used yet another opportunity to, to earn money with it, uh, have businesses earn money with it, for which the politicians claimed credit, uh, and they managed to exercise fair amount of crime against me yet again. Because this is no longer about whether this stuff took place or did not, but this is about idea, very core idea about to drive individual completely insane. Actually, bring him to the point when he already have enough, more than enough proofs to prove his case. Yet, half people sitting at top of United Nations, Amnesty International, European Court for Human Rights, and so on. Uh, which potentially could block the claim. But this, this is the claim about a crime which went on against me for no less than 28 years. And which, uh, complaints I have submitted to also Interpol, International, uh, Police Association, various organizations, and of course governments. Uh, just so it could be intercepted time and again by certain people that would simply disallow for the claim to be processed by proper people, by the proper departments, if those even exist. I'm extremely skeptical due to, uh, due to the amount of crime, due to the size of the crime. Uh, I, I sincerely doubt about everything already. Uh, and so this was yet another opportunity Slovenian police used uh, to to push forward more crime against me, yeah? At the stage through which cancer, based on human experimentation, which lasted for no less than... They introduced me to the real cancer issues in 2017. So we're talking about no less than 22 years of prior human experimentations. It was literally developed through the human experimentations, through, through the surgeries, through the surgical procedures, poisoning, uh, experimentations, which involve also all kinds of food products. And then it was finally whatever they have done to me, uh, presented to me in life as a, there you have it. It did happen though, after my meeting Benjamin Netanyahu's niece, actually she met me in Budapest in Hungary in 2017, and since, and because, since became case, this very case became undeniable, real, factual. So this is the thing, these are the things that set cornerstones, but once the case became undeniable, proven case, uh, you get awarded with a cancer. And as you know, the cancer without the medications, without the right to treatment, is a ticking clock. It is just a matter of progress uh, on extremely restricted budget and toxic environment, circumstances you find yourself in, without the right to employment, without the right to even hospital for which it's being paid for, health services, so that you can use. But you are being denied service upon examinations at a hospital. That's exactly what happened to me. During which, instead, people appeared who promised me nothing but death, failure, as a potential physicians, to completely deter you, to take every fucking hope away from you. So just so you know what this stage of the stuff I'm doing, uh, according to many people, this is the stuff I shouldn't even be doing because the case is already so much proven due to so many circumstances. Yet, this is a very powerful case. I'm going to use one against Slovenian police. Uh, I want this case to be considered as maybe even one of the main cases. I could go on and write book about it. 
but if you are willing to go through maybe two three hours next two three hours it's going to be proven to you in detail uh if not and you just want to go and consider the audio recording that you see right there the audio recording that you see right there is about 40 minute long audio recording yeah so i i can't go and just uh unless it's going to be enough time that's going to be left play this kind of stuff to you have this run for 40 minutes but what i'm going to do i'm going to pause this this is just a recording during which i attempted to contact this delivery company on december the first uh and it's it's really really miserable it's really uh what a way to not even answer an individual for whom they know very well the telephone numbers who is calling they know all that stuff um you will just have one wait in a line waste his time basically after you have committed yet another crime against one because this isn't about whether this stuff happened or not this is about overload of the crime against one for which police also anticipated I would appear myself somewhere at a police station and get in some kind of physical confrontation with someone. That was like a big deal or hopefully get me in a physical confrontation with who, with, with, with some worker inside of the store that was involved in it in all kinds of, it was people from all sorts of backgrounds that were involved in crime that police have used. Yeah, so this is about overload. This is not about whether this stuff happened or not yet but i'm going to take myself time to push this crime also forward uh reveal this crime in detail everything about how they the latest thing they orchestrated was to they managed to block me from receiving the hard drive which i ordered from aliexpress uh, before i even go with this two three hour uh video which is quite simple actually I'm going to just summarize this into maybe five minute explanation, just as I stated. The item itself, the item itself was ordered on November the 14th, 2022, was paid in four. Okay, you can see it right there, November the 14th, 2022, that's that. The cost was 1925. It should have been five day delivery. Uh, the item never ever arrived. That's the stuff I'm going to demonstrate to you how they played with the delivery of the item. I'm going to also explain to you why this stuff happened. So, uh, on what basically I requested the money back and got one after like, I don't know um 14 days or whatever wherever it was because they couldn't deliver one to the postal office in the novel mist okay so this company here that i'm about to demonstrate to you they appeared there did not have a capacity okay so i'm sure that you know here in europe this is a big big ass company this one here uh had Quarters owned, you know, headquarters owned. So based on what I have seen, oh my goodness, I think they have even in in a, in a Detroit, if it's possible. But otherwise, this is this is La Poste International, uh, and yes, just as I stated, this is a this is a French company now, and I think it's a really good company. It's a, it's a affordable, good company. They're doing a good service, except that this here, this is Slovenia. Uh, and so in Slovenia, these are Slovenian rules. But then again, due to the stuff I will be talking to you about today, uh, again, Slovenian police managed to obtain alibi for the crime from abroad yeah uh, they are strong at crime if they get a backup you know this backup 99.99 percent .99 for the crime 
came from the Buckingham Palace, from the British Royals, basically. And, well, then they managed to redistribute this to other sources to get backup for themselves. This company was founded in Germany, as you see. Uh, this is actually not in Paris headquarters today. It's uh, is uh, headquarters in Molineux, France. Um, shortly, if I would give you a description about what happened, that's basically exactly what happened. Um, The only thing I asked them is to basically deliver this to the main postal office in, in the city of the Novel Master. That's this one here, actually. Or not. Ah. Guess we don't have so much time. I'm just going to go in here. So this will be this location here. This is Glauni Turk. This is the in the city. This is your main location where you would go pick up. And yeah, uh, uh That means that you address this to a location of this postal office. It's just basically, I pick up all the packages from there with your name on it. And that's what this DPD. Um, company was not capable to deliver believe it or not as insane as it might sound but I already have a problem with my statement big one too not because something would have been wrong with me but because of the depth of the crime itself for me to finish this um, five minute explanation the only thing I'm going to do at this point is play this thing here. Okay, so to the sender. Yeah, I actually did record everything along the way, and you can see here on November the 28th. On November the 28th, finally, I got message here this is after i already requested the money that order was now returned back to france so this is finally what i got on november the 28th remember the purchase took place on november the 14th uh but other than that uh hell a real living hell man this here this stuff here this is what uh this is what what this is what went on from the day one not from the date one but uh literally uh that's how it all ended and then i requested the money back uh and you know finally it was given on november the 28th just as you have seen but that's exactly what it was it, it said delivery failed okay that's exactly what you see here this this kind of stuff now you remember when i told you i already have a problem with that statement that it was even the company who did this shit even that based on what you see here the only conclusion you would come up with would be this here yeah it's not easy to deal with the type of clientele I had involved in MKUltra. Because these are the people that make you disappear, not only packages. The problem is that... I recall when Slovenian police, psychiatrists involved in this crime against me, politicians, debated. Also an issue about how to even make me look how to even discredit the police crime against me uh, based on 
Slovenian national postal office delivery issues, which I have encountered, video recorded. He's gonna he's gonna get all these proofs and da 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 da. da. What the fuck we're we gonna do now? Well, it was a talk about how they are going to engineer a crime, literally through the company, which would not send the merchandise uh, and it would actually be later confirmed through the investigations the company did not send the merchandise. So now you, I would be going practically and claiming, oh, it's a DPD who didn't do the job, which 99.9% now most likely case is. But I have to warn you that during MK Ultra it was a debate even about fucking me in respect to the proofs I obtained from the postal office where I opened one package after another just to find worn old used items which I purchased as new either from eBay or AliExpress. You got it? So they even debated that for this, this would be like, a, like one of the last items, item, uh, it would be even done in a such a way that the item would not be sent uh, by the company from France alone. More than anything from France, this is a Chinese company, and when it comes to hard drive production, solid state drive, SSD, since beginning of 2010, before they maybe, I don't know when they started to manufacture these SSD drives, but before they started to manufacture them, this, everything went through China, literally. It was investment that it was more convenient to do it in China than anywhere else. I was at the manufacturing companies of this uh, hard disk. Actually, I think this goes all the way to 2000 and even, I don't know, 2008, God knows how far back goes. With the Xi Jinping first, uh, that, yeah, 2008, I think it was when the Xi Jinping was just going, yeah, 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 I got this deal, I got this deal. And then he delivered me to this uh, hard drive production manufacturers in China, where I would interact with these people, see these processes and stuff, and it's just the boring stuff, but for somebody that's jerked up, you know. Uh, the thing is that this happened in 2008. In 2008, he already got the confirmation. They were completely, completely back in time with the Chinese. They started already big on, in 2008. They started already to work on this project with foreign governments, of course. This is all technology from Japan, United States of America, Europe. Machines, everything is delivered to them, you know. Uh, and since the only thing that was... Americans, whenever they would come, they would they would deliver me to those companies throughout China, to the uh, to visit these owners' manufacturing facilities. So a little bit history about why I actually am suspecting that it might not even be. And you see, when you say DPD, you already are fucking me because this is the crime from Slovenian National Postal Services. And it's already French now that Buckingham Palace, British, they got them already to throw themselves uh, in front of the fact, which is quite obvious. This stuff was done in Slovenia by Slovenian National Postal Services. It was done by the Slovenian police. It was done by psychiatrists, Slovenian psychiatrists, on behalf of the politicians, on behalf of politicians on whose behalf they acted in crime against me. So this is just easy, easy, easy way, the easiest thing to, the easiest way to explain. And of course, every time that I talk about this stuff, that it was another country or a company or whatever from abroad that was involved in this stuff, the only thing I'm doing is I'm strengthening the link between the Serbs, Russians, with the countries, companies, people, politicians, royalties, which they link themselves to them through this literally 
crime. This is no fucking case. Okay? So, are there chances that actually the company that you see right there, this X-ray, this uh, discs, this company here that you see was already, this is the oldest maybe company, Chinese manufacturer that was involved, this X-ray, X-ray disc. This is very, very old one this one here this x-ray disc chinese one this one um they were doing the sales also from europe um they randomly have this for other uh, hard drives than 128 gigabytes but they did have and I was just smart enough to use this uh, to advantage and uh, basically grab this, purchase this, and uh, that's what I should got that. Uh, why am I saying that there's a possibility of what I stated? Okay, the possibility even stronger so is that Slovenian police stated me and Chinese government alone assured me they will, if necessary, assist Slovenian police. They will communicate with one another and it's going to be whatever it's going to be in mutual interests. Uh, Chinese stated whatever uh, Slovenian police, the, whichever way they're going to see it, that's the way it's going to be. Uh, they stated this inside of this delegates from China, top delegates in front of the police inside of this room, psychiatrists and so on. I wouldn't expect them to state anything else because they didn't have any choice. Hey, you are in a case like this under this kind of circumstances. You don't actually have a choice to state anything other than what I stated. It wouldn't even matter if they were from Mars or from Jupiter or wherever the case would be not their fault um, however there is something to this stuff so this is my five minutes I know it goes it's it's getting longer but these are important facts to consider it was a French company that now bears liability this company also was involved in it and because you get the third party into it uh, now, it's not even a problem to actually go and give a green light to a crime which would be used to disburse claims against Slovenian National Postal Services through the third party. And B, psychiatrist Peter Kaps, who was involved in this, this is a psychiatrist who claimed he's going to cash his license. He's going to get a cash. He prepares cash. You know, psychiatrists, you guys go to work to help society, to do stuff. But this man, this psychiatry, had a different idea. He deemed that the salary was not a lucrative way. And he decided, as he stated to me on many occasions, he's going to cash his license. He stated that what he's going to do, that's why I said Chinese, very possibly did not even, with their warehouse in the Europe, in France, might have not even sent this item. Do you understand me what I'm saying? Might have not even sent this item on his behalf, on, on behalf of Slovenian police. Strong, strong, strong possibility. When I ordered this item, special I know so because Cop stated me, if you're going to see only a few items or one item, then you know it's me. Um, when, well, when I ordered this item, this was the only, the one and only item left as a 256 gigabyte item. You get it? So this is how quite easy is actually to even trace crime no understand what the fuck is going on, who is behind it all either way 
either way, and it really, really doesn't matter, you know, either way, um, either way, Kopsch is not going to be capable to wash his blame. Slovenian police will not be capable to wash They are not going to be capable to escape. It was 256 gigs, so it doesn't. It really doesn't matter. Okay, this here. Either way you turn, it's not going to be possible to do absolutely anything about it. And the crime, the way the crime was designed by the Slovenian politicians inside here that participated in this crime, it was people also like this guy here. These are the politicians that were inside in here. You know, his name is Esmago Jelincic, this guy. This. He insisted that I should not even be buying the hard drive. My God, if I only had so much fucking time like he does in his Sony, that would be fantastic. Eh? But instead that I should build one that I should buy components and even build the hard drive because he wanted to show up about how he knows and this and that. People who have no fucking worries in their mind have time and, and money have time to play, especially through this case here of mine, crime against me since everything was destroyed and police literally went to for advice and assistance on how to destroy things, what they experience the most in their stores in respect to electronic, in respect to the watches and so on. They had all the fucking doors open to the services. All he had to do is walk inside and there and the services, the service people demonstrated them at not even company's expense. It was a Slovenian state that paid for this politicians to literally learn for their own interests, for their own sake, whatever they needed to know. But really this crime was run by this guy here. His name is Borat Pahor. We go into the Borat Pahor. This is Apprentice from Milan Kuchan. Milan Kuchan was even the one who was laughing at me in respect to this very computer which the gentleman sold me on what a piece of shit this computer is going to be anyways that's not going to last and this and that he would just play me down on that MK Ultra. that's all he would do whatever they would present as an issue he would come in and just the only thing he would do is everything would be negative he stated for the hard drive I have inside of the computer that this is the hard drive is eventually soon is going to fail Anyways, he said. But what's interesting about the hard drive crime is, is basically this stuff which I already have presented in a previous video. In a video where I demonstrated in a portion on what exactly I'm dealing here when it, here when it comes to hard drive. The activities go to many fucking locations. I already hate myself a little bit because this. of this uh, language of mine, it's it's not good. Here's what my hard drive looks like. I already have presented basically what my hard drive looks like in this video, so yeah. This I is think what my hard drive looks like. 50 gigabyte is free out of 167 gigabyte. It's, it's important for me to accent so that you're not going to think that's, that the best thing since this, since this is the video about a hard drive I think would be for me to just run this program which I did on that video anyways and that's that becomes um, it's then easier to determine everything you know easy for you to see then okay that's right we are right now 
average about 47.5 gig and as I click this stuff here it has exactly its job this little program I found on the internet I found this stuff on the internet because I don't know what goes on with my laptop you know the laptop you're gonna see that through the video accounted me for about my using about 90 gigabytes you get it but the size of the hard drive itself it says right there it's 167 gigabytes so I don't understand but I really don't understand. I don't know much about computers at all because I didn't have a time to play with this matter of my priorities to solve the case and Illuminatis knew that because of my priority they will be capable to load more and more and more and more and more and more and more crime on me and it did came so that at this point in time just as I stated at the beginning of this video it was no longer even about whether this stuff happened to me or did not happen to me it was about getting the incident challenging bullying to a degree that I was capable to record to video record audio record actually brand new items even they would plot me inside of the stores no longer through the eBay or AliExpress through the internet orders but inside of the stores I would go to purchase them as a new items they would already plot me uh, items that were broken deliberately just as they promised me they would do under MK Ultra. basically they rehearsed in under real circumstances torture from MK Ultra. so this was no this is about an overload of torture this is no longer about whether this stuff happened or did not happen and knowing that I would be recording and recording and recording and recording all this they attempted just as they told me under MK Ultra the case is gonna be to push me to the limits during which I would eventually forget the, to the limits during which eventually I would even forget all about the hard drive size whatever I would have left on the hard drive and what consequently would leave me with broken hard drive and they would get another proof about how I am a careless man and I don't care and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing and this and that you get it you understand you record you record you video record but you have no place as a matter of fact you don't even get capacity says right there it's 180 gigabytes it's listed right there as 167 gigabytes but G as you're gonna see I didn't account for more than 90 gigabytes so that leaves me with a uh, trouble first of all um, because of what I stated because I started to video record power banks just as they instructed me also on the MK Ultra to video record them and they take enormous uh, space I record this I record that I record 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 I got already down with a space already to 16 gigabyte even and so I said to myself because this hard drive is so 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 something they told me you should immediately go and purchase another hard drive because this hard drive is gonna fail I said to myself you know what Sebastian let's go and what we're gonna do is we'll just go ahead and keep this hard drive somewhere on the side that we're gonna have this as a proof of crime because there must be something somewhere that's gonna be used that I can use to prove that that it was enormous amount of stuff that was used to even deprive me of what is stated right there it should be the case 167 gigs Oh, this here this is the information and you can see that for the C for the entire C it says right there 120 gig and then you see that for the user here it says 80 gig and it says for the Windows 20 and program 10 whatever that might be the hell 
it doesn't look good. Still, there is a lot of space that's fucking missing. That is nowhere to be counted for. And so I decided, I said, also because of those dark scenarios, that I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to buy myself another hard drive some way, somehow. And, of course, that was AliExpress as the first option. Uh, this, I'm just giving you a backup of how this stuff, they created this crime, okay? Uh, and so, they lured me also into the world of... Um, They were trying to lure me to purchase this here, this stuff here. They were, psychiatrist literally was, he didn't lure me. Okay, don't get me wrong, he didn't lure me. Uh, this psychiatrist, Peter Kapsch, was smart enough to lure people from abroad into his mind, crazy my mental game, which appealed to them. He lured them by... Claiming already during MK Ultra, he conversed with the foreign politicians on how this is going to be interesting because the space I'm going to have on the hard drive that you see right there, I demonstrated you on my own hard drive that I have right now installed, SSD, is going to be, if I purchase 128 gigabyte hard drive, which is going to be, he claims it's going to be your best bet and blah, 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 uh, it's going to be that was like that's how he got them into mental game into crime against me so i know that this shit was on behalf of slovenia i know who was behind this stuff he learned them that there's going to be a mental game that we're going to play that that i'm going to go for 128 gig which i'm going to realize after i buy one that it's not going to do me any good because it's going to be the same size as the hard drive i'm going to get on the computer and the laptop because this hard drive, I think it's hacked. I'm not getting anywhere near, as I stated, what case sh should be. I'm not saying anything against the seller who sold me this computer, because this guy sold, with good faith, a good laptop, used laptop, which, however, the police managed to enforce against me, purchase I'm talking about, remember, through destruction of at least three other computers. Just remember that three other computers and one tablet that was nothing what I ordered and paid for was even delivered from China. So it was nothing than destruction, ripoff, and even a theft by the Slovenian National Postal Services of a brand new tablet I ordered from China. So they could push me where the fuck I like it or not. This laptop for which I also had to pay. I got it with discounted rate, but with amount of cost that, that is behind all this, it's like I stated. I don't have anything else to say. Yeah? So now this was this is about the hard drive. So we go back. Cop stated if you're gonna go for two hundred and fifty six and if you if if you're gonna see it's gonna be few pieces or one or this and that and tra 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 tra. This company had already warehouse in Europe, from what I can recall, at least since 2015, if not even or rather 2013. This X-ray disc. At least this is what I got an idea, opinion, from Chinese who participated. All through bear in mind that I demonstrated you that AliExpress, on the request of Russian KGB, Post to me on a computer as an AliExpress before even existed already 10 years ahead of, I think it was released in 2010. Uh, since 99, since 98, a Russian KGB started to work on what AliExpress is going to look like and they started to program and show the Chinese what they want and this and that and ta 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 ta. No, 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 no. It was Chinese who did this stuff. Uh, it's just the Russian shit all over the chessboard everywhere wherever they possibly could you get it so it's easy to sit man drugged up man in front of the computer and demonstrate him something 
a design for something, architecture of the website, coming website, which no longer even exists. Uh, it was the same thing with the news. They anticipated they're going to release in the future. That's exactly the concept they have used. Yeah. So this is important for you to consider when I said earlier that Slovenian uh, government might have used this transaction, however, to disperse all the traces I obtained through Slovenian postal services. Yes, there is a possibility that this item was not even sold, uh, sent to me from France. Uh, it's interesting because it's, uh, I don't know what they say, uh, China or whatever. Uh, it could have been that the item would otherwise come from China or something like this, but I don't know. I don't know anything about this. If if you go here and you order this, 128, it's the same delivery option. China Warehouse Standard. That, I don't know what that would be, that beautiful sound. We're going to go back here like this. And you can see here, from France, okay, from France to Slovenia, five days. So, whichever way the case might have been, whichever way the case might have been, the Slovenian government, fear me, is behind this crime again. Psychiatrist Peter Kopsch. Uh, but then also, as I'm going to guide you through this, unfortunately also some other people from abroad, international society involved that's what I hate about this crime the most but then again there wouldn't be no crime if they wouldn't get this international society involved and when I state this then where the fuck are we with this you see that's what Buckingham Palace that's what 1-800-Cabal London Cabal created that's what they are to put into Vladimir Putin, I think they are a lifeline. I think that Vladimir Putin couldn't do anything without them. Everything they, everything Putin accomplished, it was exactly from 1-800 London Cabal. I tell you that. Now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go ahead. I demonstrated you how it all... Uh, uh, and I'm going to take a longer version. You see, for this... It already took me 47 minutes, but I don't have anything else to say in a, in a short term, in a short version, other than maybe this was interesting. That's finally in December the 1st that I called this company here. Um, in between, I left a lot of important stuff, but this is the stuff I'm going to reserve for... Uh, a video self or through yeah I I'm gonna give you a short version of that and then I'm gonna give you all that stuff with the proofs so that's up to you uh, whether you want to watch the whole thing or not if this is uh, uh, interesting enough for you to see this stuff with your own eyes you have to make your own decision but what's interesting is let's see this stuff here this hard drive didn't uh, appear here I clearly understand now what exactly it was that uh, my hard drive didn't arrive yeah it, uh, as uh, they already have placed on my the guy involved in MK Archer was also this guy here with also his the wife substitute for the hard drive that never arrived this one I found on a Facebook. Um, there it is. I'm going to block this a little bit. They make sure that when you go to the Facebook, it's a group with the computers and stuff like this that you participated, you're a member of. All of a sudden, the message appears in front of you that somebody lists item, and you get an idea. Oh, you say, so what about local marketplace? And you go to the local marketplace, and you see the guy who was involved in MK Ultra, and he's already... Another scenario right in front of you. Uh, a new scenario appears. 
20 euro crucial bx 240 gigabytes uh the thing is an individual i demonstrated you earlier stated miss margaret lynch stated me the thing is that uh you're gonna see that you're not gonna buy to me an item like this and embarrass us that you're not going to go and buy item to me and embarrass us. And it's like, why? Because it's used and because the new one costs that much money. The new one maybe is for like two or three euros more. Then you recall the guy who was involved also in Kyotra, this guy here, who is selling this hard drive, who flash me the hard drive sometimes already in uh, yeah, probably 2015 when this hard drive did not even existed yet they already had the scenario for this kind and it was like it's gonna be this it's gonna be this like first he was excited that he's gonna sell me something uh, I think it was more profitable for him and then it was like he no longer was excited about it. And it was like, it was like, it's going to be this. But this shit went on from 2015, 2017 with this very guy that you see right there. Um, and it was like really pathetic also because I was at his home and it was like, yeah, if you're not going to find nothing, then that's where you're going to come. And it's like only dots they give you. You know, you find yourself in front of the home. You find him next to you here inside of the room when he's giving you. And then this is how you connect this shit together. That's how it all sorts out this stuff itself. Uh, it's all based on dots. What your ability to recall this. Uh, abuse basically is with this. This is a torture, nothing other than that. Huh? Maybe even unfortunately for the guy, this hard drive came shortly after I saw this video about these top notch idiots uh, from YouTube. That it was, it was all kinds of stuff, and more than anything. I don't consider anything else in this world more violent than depriving somebody of 28 years of life through nothing but crime and uh, attempting to literally drive him completely insane through the laughter. Basically, insane against himself. Basically, that's what the fuck he would do. If he would laugh to this shit anymore because they involve a lot of humorous stuff in it. I think that that's... I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. This is the stuff that that um, it's better for me to keep my mouth shut right now than to say anything. Um, there is no greater violence than this. If you watch the top-notch idiots, they bring the people all the down time to tears and to the complete exhaustion and insanity completely. What about if I enforce this kind of stuff to you 24-7 for 28 years? And you notice that people are actually laughing at this, certain elites, that they have fun out of that kind of crime, out of pain and suffering. Then you probably wouldn't be happy realizing that lies they told you under MK Ultra designed literally for you to even laugh to some situations are sick as possibly could sick you know nothing other than fucking lice that the only feelings involved in this were nothing other than appetite for crime that this was actually this this is mk ultra is a remorseless killing it's addiction to the torture and i actually got myself on few occasions laughing to myself uh, you have no idea how 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 angry I became when I saw that video about the top notch idiots I don't think I'm going to be laughing to anything whatever happened 
on that MK Ultra ever again because I know where they are coming from this was the biggest specialist was 1-800 London Cabal and I'm not going to say his name but had a lot of experience in it and stayed it for as long as you know from this individual as I stated earlier a new window opened from MK Ultra. You remember when I stated to you earlier that you're not going to go buy this and embarrass us? Used for 20 euros and new one you get in the store for 22, 23. Another window popped up. Let's go online. And let's see what this is. And this window popped up to me because I sent a message to the guy and have seen that he opened the message read message but he wouldn't reply me back and I waited then I got really really pissed off not because he would be involved in this stuff not because he would do something bad this was a very nice guy considering his involvement which I, I had him and everything up to here he became involved very very uh, relatively very late this guy I'm gonna play that video um, and he's he got a really very nice uh, what it appeared to me to be a very nice female from the Czech Republic as a wife that was interested in becoming my wife for I don't know how long that's what she claimed I hate man I'm not going to say it's not possible. I'm not going to say I, I don't want to hurt feelings. Listen, and at the same time, I can't afford myself to live from that. You know, I can't afford to live from the Joker, literally, to put it plain and simple. You know, and so that the next window that opened up to me was. Let's go and get this item from online. We're gonna look. We're gonna go to the stores, see on online how much this particular model costs and this and that. Because before I didn't even look into Slovenia. And once I start looking, um, I found surprisingly low costs for this uh, solid-state hard drive right here in Slovenia. The costs of uh, 23 euros I could go and pick one up here from uh, the local company uh, which is basically based all over Slovenia it's not the company I like but when you need something for that kind of price you're not going to go in, and especially because they insisted me on that brand name Patriot it's good it's very good now when I stated this brand name Patriot uh, which I didn't even know exist in a world in a real world uh, It was another window that opened and all of a sudden I find myself <sighs> Listening about the Patriot Somebody was talking about the Patriot 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 this Patriot disc the best very good cheap very good Which one is they argued about the Patriot brand? If you look at it online, that's what I basically did. The Patriot is 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 a fairly decent company, manufacturing company for the hard drives. Uh, many of these companies actually manufacture for even bigger companies. They just operate through other names uh, to sell it cheaper, other brand more expensive, and so on. Um, and then what happened was I googled the model which I already have purchased from the local company that I stated it's called Big Bang this company a uh, very bad company actually I don't like the company because this is a company from Milan Kuchan 
it's not his that he owns the company, but this is a brand from Milan Kuchan, from Borat Pahor, uh, from Ljubljana Mayor Zoran Jankovic, from Tanya Fajon, from the people that ruined my life basically here in Slovenia. The people that we Slovenes ran away from in 91 during a referendum when we decided to part our ways with the greater Serbian Chetnik state known as Yugoslavia. That's the state that then declared war on Croatia next to Slovenia and on Croatia and on Bosnia and on Kosovo, four different nations simultaneously they want to ethnically cleanse. So this is not the type of uh, heritage from Yugoslavia times, basically, based on the political profile. It's kind of Mercator kind of stuff, basically, here in Slovenia, that I adhere to. Unless I had to purchase there, I never go there, because it's just what I stated. Okay. So, but I purchased that model, then I shortly googled that model on the internet, and I learned that Patchett is a very good company with exception to this fucking model. That that model, Patchett, uh, I don't know, what is it, 900CX or whatever, all that stuff you're going to see because it's all video recorded, is actually a very bad model. The one I learned that this is a bad model was the guy who was involved in MK Ultra. And interesting, the guy's from Serbia. He placed online exactly what I was told the case is going to be. That's the best. You know. Now we're getting into area of something that's known that... Somebody trying to cover up somebody also with other issues. Uh, but I wouldn't go that far in this case. I would just say that this is, you're going to see this model was highly unrecommended, not only by the Serbian guy, but what I realized also, at my surprise, by the German guy who also was involved in MKUltra. It's what I was told during MKUltra already sometimes in... 2000 and the least 2018 2017 it's about two years before they started to manufacture this model two years before they started to manufacture this model that this is going to be no fucking good that this is no good now I have to go and basically use a video from what Mike Tyson claimed me that I have to use to give you an idea which I don't like doing that stuff uh, because he claimed me that he's going to use this to his advantage and the video is called A Time Traveler he didn't deserve to get any kind of break for anything for all the crime he did not really Mike Tyson, time traveler. Is the video in which it can be seen that somebody was using a smartphone already back in 1995. Everybody involved in MK Ultra had a smartphone already in 1995. Mike Tyson knew everything about smartphones in 1995. He was allowed to use one? No. Not in the public. This politician here that you see here, this one here, he took a photo of me with a smartphone, Starigrad, next to Starigrad, sometimes in 96, they gave him the smartphone to use. And he was a part of this MKUltra staff members 
went for a walk and wanted me to pose over there for him with him and taking photo and tra 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 but he was not the only one it was this year just as much even more so had a stronger connections this is what the American government have used to get this little people on board this is what this little people have used to get smaller people on board a little uh, farmers a little workers they got to see not only something insane somebody on a leash drugged up but also technology of the future next to the police and all kinds of stuff like this everything all the mk ultra operation ran under what is known as wow man wow you understand that's where the time traveler is so when i said the hard disk this hard disk 2017 pff, that's nothing really that's nothing special it might have been actually even 2015 they had a circle of people that was involved in mk ultra and the circle of people also had that's why people got involved in this stuff they got involved in this crime for all kinds of reasons they had access to the future technology already in their private homes they already had items they should never even have testing items you know just as i would take a car of tomorrow let's say the car that will start to be manufactured sometimes in 2026 or something like this and i would start to drive around with him it would everybody would take a note of it you know what i mean but items like this can be used and were and are used to promote certain agendas i'm just giving you an example i have seen a lot of items like this also in poland where i was the lady demonstrated me on phone and all kinds of stuff like this that 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 recall uh but I'm just giving you an idea about what happened next. Yeah, so I went online uh, and I went to this store to look what to do, basically how to replace basically this hard drive with another hard drive. And as I stated, it was this patriot that appeared Two hundred and forty gig. So I kind of uh, came to the conclusion. I said to myself, "Well, you know, that's pretty good." No, this this stuff here, it's not. Uh, but. Considering in Slovenia that I had a access, a better price, better quality brand uh, for that price, it was just a phenomenal thing for me to take advantage of at the time. I realized, however, that thanks to these guys, this hard drive was of no good. This hardware drive was no good. This hard drive had... Uh, really really problem and it's not gonna stay with me the problem was again it ringed in my ears exactly what those guys stated it is slow and another problem with this hard drive another problem with this hard drive was 
that it was hitting the laptop due to I don't know what kind of issues and that's exactly what Milan Kuchan was laughing to me at who came even with a scenario that eventually what am I gonna do there is nothing you're gonna be able to do and if you will return one you will not be capable to buy another one because this is going to be his scenario was such under MK Ultra that they're going to even sell that stuff and that you're not going to have nothing else left for you to eventually buy as you see here one is already sold it's gone but I did video recorded the whole thing and in continuation probably even in a video number two I will be capable to demonstrate you the stuff I am talking about right now. It's actually here. Patriot P210 129. Actually, no, this is a one to 128 gigabyte, but that one I'm talking about had a 256 and it's already sold out. So he was very pessimistic. It's, it's right here. Look at it. It's right here. So that pushed me a little bit different. This is a good company, but no good model that this company manufactured. What now? Well, the first thing I did was since I already paid for one also here in Slovenia, I got the money back from, for the one from AliExpress. Just about maybe half an hour after purchase, I left the message canceling the order is probably was 20 minutes after that that I am asking for a refund and I never got the phone call back nothing and even portion of the message which I had left all this stuff is video recorded was deleted I even I even mailed them uh, to their company on various addresses to please address this issue that I don't want this item I'm canceling the delivery of this item and would instead prefer what you see here this is a PNY item if only it's possible and so on and so forth um, you know then I started to think about all these scenarios company itself big bank and I said to myself, you know what, fuck this. They caused me another loss of time because time is more expensive than anything else here. And all this shit was actually designed to, to put extra strain on my hard drive I'm recording with right now. But then I decided, I said to myself, you know what, fuck this. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to fix this hard drive. And when I have the opportunity, I'm going to go to Ljubljana and I'm gonna get myself a hard drive of my choice. And this here, this is the search engine that you would use here in Slovenia to get the cheapest deal. Uh, something that many stores are including in this business, uh, in, in whatever. This is like universal search, whatever, whoever wants to participate in this site here they would list with this company and you choose like let's say from this uh let's go and we're gonna do this stuff here because i want to just be so did you see that these are more or less this is this is again more or less the same kind of articles, more uh, items, I mean, again, we're going pretty much through the same, same, same stuff. And you're going to see that, again, you see right there, those are exactly the most important words that I say, the same items, basically, the same items. See, same brands, same items, same, same shit that you have seen over there, more or less the same stuff. So... Let me just grab one of this here, as long as it doesn't have a 240 gig. 
But the Kingston, you don't even have, you don't even, you have not even seen one there for that price. But if I click here in this Kingston with a 240 gig, you're going to see there are stores. It says here stores, you see. And they have, again, in this company, Big Bang. And then they also have another company, such as the Parcom, and they have another one here and another one here. The problem is that you have to go all the way to Ljubljana to get it. But you can see, that's interesting, that it's always the same companies. They have the same shit. And that's the main idea. I got it. Um, here's the deal, ladies and gentlemen. As I started to browse, there's another window that opened to me inside of this room related to MK Ultra. Now I started to understand what the fuck went on. This was something else. This was not a sale of hard drive. What they insisted me is going to be a Black Friday. You know, this was a Black Friday. You know, last week. It was the Black Friday. Uh, it was actually a way to fuck you up completely. It was just video record and video record and video record and in the end you would have this your hard drive, your own hard drive, fell apart. It all added up together. Next to this French DPD company, uh, which had... French really had nothing to do with this stuff. Uh, I mentioned the German guy. I mentioned the guy from Serbia. I, I went on, and that hard drive with an NPNY, it was the guy... Um, I don't know. I think I think uh, he resides in Germany. I I didn't have a time to go over that stuff. That's something I want to play you. And I yet have to go and see. Whenever it's time, there's so many people involved in this stuff that he would be uh, pointing out that PN PNY hard drive that I demonstrated you as a good one. When you see this, like this. He was involved also in MK Ultra, and I understand even in the Polish Hunger Games, you have to involve him, whatever. And so it was like a way from international corner done in a such a way that they wanted me to see this guy, that guy, this guy. <laughs> yeah, you get it. But what the fuck I have out of this? My hard drive is failing over there. And I did spoke to you about the top-notch idiots. And at this point in time, I'm actually with so many problems to solve that I find myself in a really, really funny world. Just as I stated at the beginning of this video, with so many proofs about crime that the fucking crime doesn't count anymore to me. It would be more beneficial at this point. It's more beneficial to me to com complete the complaint and send one out. Because the thing is that despite the proofs I have there is nowhere in Slovenia no police department I could eventually feel myself feel I could rely on to investigate this stuff because it's all so interconnected criminally interconnected with one another it so intersects itself that in the end you lose 28 years of time and the whole thing adds up to exactly zero. The people that in 95 I wanted literally to hang and shoot in front of the walls already in 1995 when it started this stuff I requested from the Slovenian territorial defense to take arms and if the police does not want to perform their job to literally march on the police station and take control over. Just like you marched on Yugoslav Federal Army centers during the war for independence in Slovenia, that's what you ought to do when corruption to this degree took place. I told them under MK Ultra in 95, in 96, in 97. Man, they went on to dismiss the fucking... Slovenian draft based on draft military because of me. That's how shitty conscience was. Rather than to do the job, rather than to do what required for them as a citizen, duty, they went and they dismissed the fucking draft service military in Slovenia. 
without resolving this case in any way. So this is not good stuff. You know? So you lose 28 years of life and now uh, the enemy of you, that's me who represented European Union, United States of America here in this country during what used to be close to Soviet Union, if not even worse, and got fucked because of this, now gets to cooperate and turn the people that should be on your side, that should side with you against you. That's not good. That's not good. That's a bad stuff. And you get zero out of all this and minus 28 years. That's a bad punishment and torture for these 28 years. That goes beyond forced unemployment. So that's not good, right? That's not good stuff. If anything can be worse than worse than forced unemployment. So, a new Windows pops up to me. And I started to observe this shit here. This stores. And uh, I can clearly, clearly... A recall in the room. It was about Intenso. Intenso is a company that also began to manufacture hard disks, but they became famous about manufacturing SD cards. And those were the most affordable SD cards that I needed at one point in time back in, oh, I don't know, maybe 2010, whatever. Uh, and I ran here to this local store, Miller, German store, and I bought those SD cards, and they were really good, pleased with those. And all of a sudden I hear, not here, but I recall in the room, people talking to me, and you want Patriot, it was all about Patriot is good, Patriot definitely, we're going to order Patriot, Patriot. Before the foreign people from abroad arrived, they had me drugged up here. It was always like this, that they would take day two, maybe even more, to torture and so on. Then they would, oh, we got him or whatever. And then the people would pop up from abroad. And so I, I clearly call of this about the Patriot, 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 Patriot. So you're going to, you're going to order the Patriot? Yeah, I'm going to order the Patriot. is definitely. And you said you, you said you, you said about uh, uh, Intenso that is good that is Intenso that you like the Intenso to me, drugged up I was all of a sudden it was in the room the German people that arrived This was actually even after the politicians already were here. Yeah. The politicians were here. There was all kinds of politicians from Austria, from Germany, but the Germans handled everything for Austria. Austria didn't have nothing really. This was really German business more than anybody. The, the main people here, in this case, you're talking about German people, Germany. This is the company in Austria, this one here. The thing is, it's also in Germany. It's called Media Markt. Germans are the biggest handlers probably in Europe. It's quite international company, Europe-wise. It's becoming something almost like a Lidl, like a Hofer. You see this company, Media Markt? The German politician or Austrian or whatever it was, I, I bet it was German. It was German politician, 100%. Germans.
Austrian politician talked to the German politician, but he was German politician always. He said, okay, he said, I'm going to go on the phone and I'm going to get my guy here. Are you talking about the people on the level of Angela Merkel here? Politicians. I'm going to go on the phone, I'm going to get the guy here. Okay. Okay. So, okay. Then, the next day or whatever, maybe even hours later, because it was not only once this happened. It was, yeah, they would have the, Angela Merkel would always have handlers, uh, minister or politician, some that would call another one, just tell this, 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 whatever they need. And the only thing you need is, the only thing you see is, if they couldn't come from Germany with a car, drive from Germany literally with a car, and they must have gone 200 kilometer plus an hour on an autobahn to get here. I, I tell you, man, Germans came from Germany here in a few hours with the cars. Talking about handlers, CEOs, people, people from businesses to meet here with the people. Ah, Slovenia. Slovenia is, Slovenia is just something that it was here next to Russia. That's how they got this people here. This was a big, big, big shit. This is a global stuff that went on. And so by this, to make people, they literally went in their ass, basically, to make them feel, yeah, 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 yes. It was the guy, the last time that this happened, was actually even the Austrian guy who substituted, that was involved in this, that drove from Austria here from Mediamarkt. And he came here, and it was, it was, it, it was literally maybe the cost of what they got for their company, Media Mark, that he offered here to Slovenians, right? That's how good fucking price this was. Now, how did Slovenian side bought this stuff? Ha! Huh. Slovenian side, and um, I, I gotta say, regretfully, people like Luise Peterle, and other people were involved in this stuff that never ever should be. Because how the fuck are you going to resolve this case of yours? You, you're, you're getting bitten up over there and you have politicians that should be opposition basically inside next to these people also doing this kind of stuff. You can't because it's a, such a degree of corruption. You're dead buried. You really are a live buried actually. You can't out of, get out of this shit because it's it's... It's the businesses that, that are doing this like this. They're bagging the politicians and you're like this from businesses and politicians. They don't want this shit to end because it's such a fucking good price. Everything is so good. Everything is fantastic. The money is fucking flying. It's addiction. Addiction to torture. Addiction to this. That these people fucking live for this shit. Who, who the fuck is doing this? Those that are addicted to the violence, those that are addicted to low-cost items, so they they destroy the competition. Now I'm getting to the competition. If you are not in this circle, people did not even exist with the private businesses if, if they didn't get into the circle. This is how bad these prices were. This is what it meant to be inside of the circle, a matter of survival for the merchants, for the businesses, for the private companies. Now you're fucked when you get, when you become a moho like this for the private party and for the politicians, you're fucked. Your life is ruined. You're buried alive. The biggest one of them all was this company, Big Bank, that I presented you. This is this Milan Kuch and Power company. This is the one they pushed forward everywhere. The Slovenian government did. Then it was a private sector. The private sector were, let's say, as you have seen under that companies that I demonstrated you right there.
So this is this is a German, this is an Austrian company. The guy comes here. It, it used to be a German guy that would come from Munich area, maybe even a little further north, like Nuremberg area or something like this. And this guy was doing some other stuff. And then he got already department from Austria because in Austria, the same shit, this kind of a publicly trade company is, what they do is they have a filiale, basically in German language, a filiale branch with many other companies that operate and in Germany and in Austria under different names in the same way, just as now through my eyes, have gathered themselves in Slovenia to do business with Germans. This Austrian became deputized by the German government to represent the Germany basically inside of this house, inside of this room. So this guy just deputized him and he came here from Austria then. Beginning sometimes 2015 it was the Austrian guy that will be coming. But before this it was the German guy that they had for the business deals. And he drove I also drove with him from Germany to to Slovenia with his car he would be driving. And so this guy, a substitute of the German guy, therefore from this company, from the Media Mark, arrived here. And the first thing that it was, it was this guy from this biggest company, Big Bang in Slovenia that he would be discussing these issues with we in a presence of maybe two other individuals which however represented this smaller companies here that you see here Semetic, Biro, uh, Shopster Shopster was also big whatever and then this Parcom and Top Solutions and so on and so forth yeah, they had like a private company I don't know which exactly companies were but you can see it here you, it, it can be easily Okay, then it was another company that started to grow big in Slovenia. It was this one here. This was already present. This, this one also they had, they had uh, for the public sector, which was a bank representative, Slovenes, and they had also for the private sector, however, they had this one here. From this company and another company, it's called Mimo Verste, this one here. Yeah, so you have two representatives like this, and you have a representative from a publicly trade company, Big Bang. Yeah, you understand? Three guys, one Austrian guy, who became substitute for the German guy, as I stated earlier, to trade. On behalf of Germans items here with Slovenes. So this was the biggest guy, was this guy here from Big Bang and he had two guys from the private party and they discussed these issues, which item, which one you want, how many of this, what you, uh, a price, what is the price for this and that, 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 that. Then what they did is they stood up, if it was three guys, usually, actually it would be like two guys, one for private, another one for this here, for big bank and the one for private. Then the only thing they would do is they would stand up and they would go in the kitchen. They would go from this room and they would go in the kitchen. In the kitchen, there would be like five people more from a representative from different companies that I demonstrated you here and mentioned you also, this Anna and Mimo Verst and so on. Okay? Then there would be a discussion uh, this and this and this for such and such a price. This and this and this for such and such a price. And then you would hear. Uh, so you're going to take this. You want so many and so many of that. So many and so many of this. And da 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 Then the guy will return back here inside of this room. I know that you're fucked now when you're listening to this. Because I remember everything what the fuck went on here. I know that now. Because I know that you listen to everything I fucking say here inside of the Zoom. That's how disgusting this shit is. Now, the guy who would return back, in, you know, those guys, it would be maybe even one guy that would return. No longer two guys. 
he would sit with a German guy or Austrian guy and he would say so many, so many this, so many, so many that, so many, so many this, da 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 and that's that, basically. That's that. That's that. The next thing, that's all there is. You have a good price here in Slovenia, kind of a crazy, excellent price. Sometimes even better price than in Austria, based on my observation. Definitely was the case in Poland like this. The same shit. The same thing, the same, the same, the same, this totally, totally the same, identical, identical, identical stuff. You understand? That's, you want to ask me how, who and how, I tell you exactly how, not only who. Okay, of course I remember the German guy was very German and he was a taller guy. And the Austrian guy was not so, uh, he was like light skin, light hair and... The Austrian guy was not so, uh, was like more like um, Austrian, no, Austrian, more like myself. Yeah. So yes, you have intense on all in Slovenia, big time, because of exactly what I stated to you. You have this one here, you have this actually a gigabit but there is your kingstone right there the one that you have seen a little earlier intenso all the items that you have seen previously in slovenia there are for sale and stuff yeah there you go i'm not gonna say that all of them because i don't know <laughs> it's not this here alone that is doing the job but this is basically this is the way it was it was something about how to even scatter the proofs about this stuff Kuchan was contemplating on but I was told if you already tell stuff like this there is no fucking way they can escape anywhere this is traceable all the stuff that I stated there is nothing nobody can do about it okay so did you see that this hard drive had a definitely much much bigger meaning i was also rated as i would be rated also as crazy insane if i would go and buy one how much exactly do i remember this even the police girl from the united states of america the red hat from hey i'm not gonna tell you exactly but it was i think south carolina area uh, told me something she started to talk about something that is actually going to be seen how much common sense I have and stuff like this if I'm going to what actions I'm going to be doing and this and that all kinds of stuff like this it was for all kinds of shit all kinds of reasons enough for me to write a book about this bullshit because it went on for so long again so this was just poised to happen, this item not being delivered. And there you have it. They provided again alibi for the crime to the people that ruined my life. People that ruined 50 fucking years of my life. If it wasn't people like this, you think I would be going to the United States of America? No. I would never go. To, in 95, I would never go to the U.S. Because I would have no reason to go. So, you know what the fuck you did? You didn't go and do something like 28 years. You ruined my entire life, basically. You ruined the whole fucking country. You ruined the people's future. You ruined the right of the people to self-determination, to tell you quite honestly. Yeah, you in London, you did. 1-800-London-Cabal. I know, I know, I know, I know. Top-notch idiot, yeah, I know. I know, 24-7 too. And to what kind of issues you get this shit done, huh? Forcing guy to actually lose all the data and stuff like this. And so on and so forth. So, this is the short version of it. Let me see the time. Oh, look at that. It's one hour and 40 minutes. So, you know what? I'm going to go ahead now and I'm going to do the same thing. The only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to be technical. 
but still because of what I stated I'm gonna have to go and be technical enough about to give you again the same la 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 the same shit the same uh, the same uh, the same stuff uh, now I realized uh, that it was time for me to either transfer data on external hard drive or simply lose my hard drive now you see right now it's already 46.7 so this is going to be a big size video um yeah you know what let me go and let me just okay so how this whole bullshit ended in the end how it all ended uh, why not buying a hard drive and basically hanging on the phone on december the first talking to myself basically while calling this company DPD delivery company therefore like this <laughs> with the agents yeah. made me hang on the phone all this top-notch video stuff. 40 minutes. They would never ever. They would. They would. So again, it, they would put me in line as a. Obviously, it was as a 10 customer, and the second time I was a nine customer. And every time it would be my turn, uh, they would put me on hold. They would not converse with me, but they would put me on hold. And the only thing I would then get to listen is a fucking merciless music that will play. I no longer would get automated message during the music, which was completely insane. I responded and then... This... Comp this, this <laughs> you know, it's crazy. I mean, music and telling you that everybody's busy and boom, 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 and boom, 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 like somebody would be trashing you. It went on like this for 40 minutes, believe it or not. And I'm going to put the whole audio recording. That's how it all ended on December the 1st. And there is nothing else to say. This is this is totally in a style of top-notch idiot. But it's designed to actually not only eat your hard drive, but your life. 28 years of it. And it's expected of you to pick on a humor on a funny issues they they created like you know, in MK Ultra they played out that you're gonna see yourself we are royals and this and that and you're gonna be laughing to yourself while you fucking rotten a life with a cancer so that's all there is that's how it all ended on December the 1st you're gonna see this whole audio recording I'm gonna place underneath but I, you know what since I'm doing this kind of stuff and it's gotta be done and it, it doesn't matter if it's one o'clock in the morning Let's go. And we're going to finish this video. As a matter of fact, I'm going to get this video done right now. Because I did give you a good explanation about what this is all about. And I feel that right now, probably, you see this is, this is, you see, this is what the five minutes looks like? The best thing for me right now is to just go through with it. And I mark these videos for you to see it like this. Oh, you can see the date and time. For me not to waste on this very issue I'll go ahead and I'm going to reload this then I'm going to go straight to the matter here is this thing here you're going to do it again so this was November the 23rd when I started to record this stuff because it didn't make any fucking sense there was no item didn't come nothing nothing and uh it was already quite a few days past five day delivery <laughs> this was no five day delivery aha it's right there frcd gb chrono post networks delivery attempt unsuccessful wow how the fuck is going to be unsuccessful when this is actually a postal office you're supposed to deliver this stuff that's not possible man ah <laughs> there you go post restante 8105 that is the address from the main postal office in the center of the city 
and the delivery was unsuccessful. Okay, so for whatever reason they did this delivery or to disburse Slovenian National Postal Services for the crimes against me, uh, which police access. I'm again subject to the bullshit because this is a private company that provided service. Oh, I'm what is serious. The man? Okay, so this is Why when not? I started to video record this stuff. That I was not. The delivery has failed. It's unsuccessful. This is a kind of a surreal when everything is unsuccessful. When you. Yeah, you, I know. I get yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't know what it did. It doesn't matter. I already did create it. That's something that's good, so it's not going to eat me too much memory either. So the next thing I'm going to take you is actually. The mouse is not performing very well. The mouse is jumping. It's all designed in such a way to, to, for me to look crazy due to computer problems. So look at this. I don't have to move the mouse anything and it's just clicking. The mouse itself is clicking automatically. So the next one is this one here. That was on November the 24. I'm not sure, man, whether the hell this is five day delivery and five-day delivery black friday and all this stuff i was told during mk ultra by now buy this before this black friday because then it's going to be over and this and that and really uh i get this opportunity for that money i don't have to go and worry about ddv which is added tax i commit myself to this purchase all oh, freaking happy even better psychiatrist so peter cops stating me they told me that they're gonna see if i'm insane or not <laughs> They stated me, well, what we're going to do is, we're going to actually, because you're going to be browsing this stuff, and then we're going to see whether you're crazy or not. So, so far, I managed to avoid what I eventually was going to even commit myself. If you pay attention here to this, you can see actually that I was going to go and purchase two hard drives the size of 128 gigabytes but then i realized i said to myself you're gonna go and you're gonna throw away the money for something that you don't actually it's not gonna even fulfill your needs and it was actually exactly exactly according to um It was designed exactly, exactly according to the MK Ultra scenario, uh, in which the psychiatrist Peter Kopsch insisted me that I will be actually buying. I see it here. You can see 256. Then I canceled twice 240 because further down I realized I said to myself, "You're gonna buy two of this." First option that I was going to go is going to be too small, 128, didn't make sense. I realized. Then I said to myself, why the hell are you going to go and you're going to buy two products from China for which you're going to have to pay added value, DDV, extra, when you can, you only need one disc size of 240 not rather than 128 yeah don't throw away money i said to myself this one here was perfect it was in europe five day delivery boom and i went for it yeah so i'm just giving you the whole thing about how i even avoided catastrophes this company also was involved in mk ultra this golden fear also was involved in mk ultra this company I was told actually it's even owned by American. I was told it's actually even American that owns one. I don't know because it was so much that I'm going to say, excuse me to my language, but this was such a monkey business that you really didn't know who owns what. Uh, they had people from United States of America, engineers that they demonstrated on machines and also how to run the production. They had American engineers I was with in China also inside of those production facilities, manufacturing facilities. I was told by the people 
which were actually Chinese wholesalers also that were involved when I was in China. They, Xi Jinping had, whenever they were meeting Americans who would go there to for purchase. You see, Americans, on the other hand, were using me as a mojo uh, to buy from the Chinese. So, you see, I was all over the place for one or the other reason. And it was this uh, Chinese man, young guy, that would be walking with us, that I also remember him also, um, that we would go with this guy from, it was like in the building, and in that building it was more manufacturers and stuff based. And um, we would go from one facility to the other. And uh, the only thing that would happen is, um, he stated, whichever one you're going to buy, he stated, he stated this to us, and it was American who wanted to help me. He said, don't, don't even think. They are good. They are all good. Which one is good? They are all good. And many of them work for the bigger companies, which is not known. They produce, they manufacture certain things. Okay? So they told me, uh, you have bigger and you have a smaller companies. And they told you, but it's all based on the, the same machine, the same production. So they told me, uh, don't be fooled by the price because it's cheap. They are all good quality. That's what they were convincing me. Um, now they always obviously there is a difference. There is, it's no good really if it's if it's a crazy temperatures that can really destroy your laptop. Don't buy that kind of stuff and uh, it's so overly slow and stuff like this. It makes no fucking sense. Um, so. They told me, whichever one you're going to buy, you don't have to worry about because they're all good quality. Okay, so that's all I wanted to say. That's all I wanted to add to all this stuff. I don't know how much sense does it make, but yeah. This is, I started to video record this stuff. <coughs> about this stuff not being delivered. It's a possibility I'm going to get the second COVID. I don't know. Mother don't want to even tell me what's going on. Yesterday, uh, she started to act funny at night time. Today, I already feel like I have, might have something. Delivery failed. It's nice to live with an individual that doesn't even tell you what the problem is. And then the second day, you yourself become sick. It's, it's really nice. So, this is the time, basically. That's already 24. That's already 10 days went past. Uh, I am struggling here with this money at least to get back. There is nothing else I would add at this point. You were able to see. It appears that uh, somebody is really busy on my computer and that somebody it's not me. This also needs to be video recorded. Look at this stuff here. Yeah, this uh, is very, very, is very nice here, no? because what I'm using this at this about? point in time. Uh, I have noticed um, at this point in time, okay, at this point in time, that's like cute. <laughs> this is cute. Uh, all of a sudden, uh, I don't know what the hell I would tell you. Uh, it's when I started to talk about um, Israel. Uh, I, I'm not the one who went ahead and then changed here this to delivery to Poland and the settings to Hebrew language. <laughs> uh, literally Chinese told me, do not talk against uh, Israel, this and that, and ta 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 ta, which I do not appreciate. Because whatever is between me and Israel is between me and Israel, not between me, China, and Israel. I don't work like this. Whatever is between me and Israel is between me and Israel. Whatever is between me and China is between me and China, not Israel. That's basically how I do the business. I don't allow anybody to condition with absolutely anything. It appears that uh, somebody Especially really because I'm not at my fault. computer. And, and however, everything all me. of a sudden changed into, to be into a Hebrew. Look here. at this stuff here. Sorry, I don't understand. Uh, I don't understand. Maybe the Chinese people think that... Uh, even the writing, I don't know how to read that writing. Delivery failed. So this message repeats 
and repeats and repeats and repeats and repeats, repeats open dispute. Voila! And I'm actually... This shit here repeats over and over and over again. Maybe I'm gonna do something like short. Um, a short movie just uh, as a proof or something like this. But I'm not gonna go and burn the hard drive for what I stated you. I have a problem. Also due to low memory. You know, I filed a complaint on November the 25th. A refund, my money, item, never was ever, appears never even was sent. I paid so much and so much. I protest. I exercise my protest. So, that. so this is pretty damn One miserable. Miserable this. stuff, miserable as possibly can be. You need something to save yourself life. Uh, yet you don't get to see any of it. Here, yeah, I am going right, to use this. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. What's what's... Situation. Order returned. Okay, so we're going to finish the deal with... November the 28th. ...through extra problems. Now, um, and basically, this is just for not delivering the merchandise. Order is being returned. Got a new status that order is being returned. Wow, not that I was aware of it. But pay attention to this number here. Pay attention to that number right there. Because this is the number that I demonstrated you earlier. Then I have called, but not earlier than on December the 1st. I am not fucking calling anybody, sir. The postal office in the city of the Novo Mesto is open. 24... No, 24-7 not. But every day from, I don't know, 7 o'clock to 7 at night. Something like this. You are not going to fucking tell me that you are not capable to deliver my item to the postal office where I pick all other items you, as a professional delivery company, I am not going to be calling you. Especially not, because, you know why not? Because I pay for five-day delivery. And if you think that I'm going to be losing money on the fucking delivery, that I don't even know what you might have done with that uh, item and this and that, I pay you to get the item here, not for you to... I pay you actually so that item would not go through the Slovenian customs. Items that you purchase within the European Union don't go through the customs. So, that you're going to give me some kind of delivery and I'm going to be asking where the item is when item already long ago should have been here? No, 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 no. I called on December the 1st. Basically, I tried to call just to inform myself formally what exactly happened to the item. And the people where I called, they knew my telephone number very well. Customer number 10. Now you're customer number 9. Now you're customer number 8. Now you're 7. Now you're 6. Now you're 5. 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold on a moment. And then... Nobody answers. The music goes on, driving insane. You have to call back. You understand what I'm saying? It's what you call a overkill. It's what you call overkill. I don't want this. When you pay for five-day delivery, you don't want that. And the main idea when I called that number was DPD, was just to get an idea of basically to find out what happened. They wouldn't even answer about that issue. They they don't they, they knew exactly who I was. They didn't bother with that stuff even. So the order now returned back. So the
I clearly understand now what exactly was that. Uh, well, we already, I already right? have given you a good explanation about yeah, this stuff yeah, here, about the media me mark. Understand what exactly happened? And I just want to know whether there is some other stuff here that. Aha, uh -huh, okay, no, this is here, this is what it is. I totally get it. Okay, so this is the guy that I see now here, that I mentioned you earlier. I started to understand yeah. what went on. The item didn't come, now this guy pops up. Through the Facebook I find this guy. That's his item right there. Then I go and I video basically record about him exactly what he did yeah, I go I here I go down this. Uh, before I go down I see this picture here oh, this this picture I see this picture here this picture I see this picture here I know I know I know what I I was dealing with that's Iceland and I don't think I have to add anything else to this I'm just going to scroll down. Boy, I thought I am going to explode then, from the anger when I saw this shit. So did you see that you get an idea how updated the people that are involved in MKUltra with my... Even what with angered my me in respect to this guy, what angered me in respect to this guy, what I didn't finish earlier, what angered me about this fucking guy was that he didn't reply me back. And it's not that what angered me that, that is that, that he didn't reply me back. <laughs> it it didn't anger me that he did not even reply me back that he was involved in MK Ultra, that I didn't get the hard drive so I would communicate with him that's not what angered me what pissed me off is that my case is listed on a fucking dark net I was taught it's listed on a fucking dark net that you had to have some kind of uh, I don't know because I don't know shit about computers really so that you can access darknet and uh, uh, it's it's the case that 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 everything is written about me anywhere from the women that I dated anywhere from the taste for the food anywhere from the cars that I drove what I like about every fucking thing about me Okay, the thing about it is that next to the access that people have about my private life, special access granted by somebody from Buckingham Palace from London, the guy appears because I contacted one that it appears to me that he need the fucking permission to communicate with me because when I sent him a PM and he wrote he read what I wrote to him because it, it appears that he reads something that he saw when you write person stuff uh, that he still is not allowed to fucking talk to me straight and that shit happened to me already before the people that were involved in MK Ultra, when I asked questions out of nowhere and stuff that I appeared and so on it appeared to me at times, if he was communicating through the computer and stuff, that it was somebody else they also communicated with. It appeared to me clearly that it was other people that intercepted and were started to give instructions, or maybe were not even sure about what steps he should take then in respect to my case and so on. His darling from Czech Republic wife, who moved to the city of Novo Mesto, told me because of me and so on, told me, you must be nice, you must be nice, and this and that, I don't like the idea, and this and that, da, 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 and that kind of stuff. Uh, it, it, it pisses me, it pissed me off that the man, it appeared to me, could not even talk to me like a customer, somebody who was interested in a fucking hard drive buying from him, but that he need to go through somebody over there in London literally to give him a green light for whatever. No, I know that it's not Buckingham Palace that gives instructions and so on, but because it's this kind of game, they have people that 
probably they have to communicate and those people communicate them what is the next in line the next bullshit top notch idiot trick treat in line for me so that's what I didn't like about it I didn't care about his involvement in case I didn't care about whatever but what really angered me is just that I don't know how much you have noticed today everything is working just fine with my hard drive it appears that we are now actually that I'm just doing this by myself I don't have other people transmitting this throughout the world this recording uh, that's that's basically what 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 bigged me basically that I was very very I became really miserable about that I didn't even fucking deserve the answer when I inquired about the damn hard drive that I wanted to get after clearly this was the fucking guy that was involved in MK Ultra. you see on how many locations he was in Iceland where he would also take me in London in 2015 to the same fucking place where I was with other people since 95 and stuff like this since it all started and so on I, this isn't about identifying people anymore this is about fucking coming to an end to where the fuck end here is these people in London are sick as anybody possibly can be sick these are fucking mentally ill people this is exactly what people from Asia told me in 95 when I started to work on this shit we're gonna be joking and you're gonna come to us with ideas so that you're gonna joke with us and the only thing we're gonna do is we're gonna stop joking and even give you a slap I'm gonna give you a slap the guy said he gave me like two three slaps like this when I approached and I didn't even get why the fuck I got these slaps I mean it came to me but I couldn't believe these people in London are such a evil people because he told me this we have seen many many times this is the only thing that's gonna happen is gonna be ah ha ha ah ha ha ah ha ha already in 95 they told me they knew this game already this MK Ultra game more than what's <sighs> finally came to me and in the United States of America the same shit the people try to warn me over and over and over and over about what Prince Andrew what Prince Charles finally in my face began to make fun out of me if it's gonna be their way or it's gonna be finally already the slapping or in other words what people were trying to uh, alert me about them they alone started to make humiliation based on my human dignity based on my loyalty to them if you want to say this support for the royals fuck royals like this if you're royal you should be aware about people like this you should be aware about what these royals are doing to the people that basically supported you so hard drive on a Facebook yes I don't know here you see what is it here this is what um, Iceland and uh, okay and plenty other locations okay about my Again, Iceland 2014, 2000, Britannia 2015, you see this here, here many times, here I was here, all this, I don't even want to talk about this stuff, really, this is all Britain, so good for me, Silent. so this, this year was a problem, this, this year from, this year was Czech a girl that moved apparently from the Czech Republic to marry this guy, both of these guys were really nice. Um, this was actually nice. This, this guy was not so bad. This guy was not so bad, but the girl My that... Decline in her view. I mean... The girl who studied in Ljubljana at a university and would take me along with her to get herself uh, and cheaper stay and I don't know what else kind of good is stuff 
people got themselves through involvement in MKUltra also had a brother, from what I can recall. And this was a very, very hard case. Apparently that I didn't like her because she had a dark hair, like myself, or whatever. Stupid shit as hell. Torture, all kinds of stuff, and so on and so forth. Out of all this. They're gonna think about this, they're gonna think about that, and blah, blah, blah. Uh, this, as I stated, however, none of this shit was a problem to me. What totally maddened me, angered me, is that when I contacted him, I felt that somebody was reading the messages and would not even fucking reply me back, say, hello, hi, yeah, I'm such and such, can I help you? You know, you have questions to uh, for me to answer and stuff like this. That's what I didn't like about it. Uh, what is this here? And I try nothing on Facebook. For me, this is uh, actually for me. It was always the same. Thing. So this is this is what I already told you all about that stuff. Okay, <laughs> I see that that this this is already heading into. This shit here, I'm this surprised is, uh, that you still have one. That's crazy. That Part was the hard drive that I paid for the from this company, this the known, and the known as Big Bang, just as I told you in the beginning of the video, just to realize the warnings through the internet about this patchy particular model of the hard drive that is just not a very good hard drive. Slow for writing is exactly what I was taught at least in 2017. Uh, because you're going to be doing movies and stuff like this. Plus, it's going to lift the temperature and it's going to destroy your laptop. Probably the damn thing is not that bad, but why not to avoid if you can? You will send me the bill. You would like to have the bill? This shit here, this, I don't know what to tell you. That's crazy, bad crazy shit. This immediately after I committed myself to to a purchase of this um, immediately upon committing myself to purchase of this item I notified immediately this company that I don't want one and I send them uh, also next to November the 30th, uh, your order is accepted, uh, follow, the, uh, follow the order, this is the order, the only thing that I'm angry is that not even they have even deleted this, the, the stuff about which I have written them down. Uh, nobody called back the next day. Nobody called back the next day. Nothing. Nothing. Like, I don't exist. I was inside of this company and they even orchestrated in respect of this hard drive item. How I will not contact them and the only thing they're going to do is they're going to charge and send the item and fuck you. No, literally the next day I called them up. Uh, it is insane shit. On November the 30th, I already have contacted these people. Clearly can be seen. And you can see the time here. At 22.13, the same day, 20-30 minutes after the order, I submitted them the cancellation. Would you think nobody really was concerned about contacting me and canceling the order? Actually, I asked them to send me instead this, uh, instead of that item, another item, and so on and so forth. And the message, which was this one right here, this was the message, was missing from the message that you see. The only thing that was left here was this thing here. This here was actually missing. Nobody called, nobody nothing. I called these people. I called these people. I called these people. Uh, so actually, this is also audio recorded this shit. 
I did. I called these people uh, to the company. The lady stated, I'm going to call you back. And you know what happened? Uh, they did not call me back. After one hour, I waited for one hour. I said, fuck this. Nobody's going to call me back. They're going to ship me this item. And this and that. These people completely have forgotten from me about me. I pick up the phone. I started to dial the number. And just as I called them, you understand? I could not reach their number. In the moment that I called them, I could not reach the number. My telephone started to ring. So what the fuck that tells you? That tells you they monitor you 24-7. That you are like in a cubicle. As Americans refer to my room, they refer to my room as a lab. Experimentation lab. Human experimentation lab is how they refer to one as. Okay? So... All I could do is basically say thanks. Because within an hour, there was no call. And when I pick up the phone to call them and call them, it was the call I received from their end. Yeah, you got it? They are not even omitting, hiding their intentions. It's a top-notch idiot style, basically, to drive you insane. Basically, letting you know that they keep up with you 24-7. And that there is nothing basically that you can do. I have audio recorded all this stuff. And I'm going to create the video. I'm going to post that online. Just as you follow this, what I'm saying right now. And you're going to compare to the data. That I'm going to post other videos below. You're going to be able to confirm what I state. This is no, This is the way it is, basically. Listen, I changed my mind. Because the company was Big Bang. It belonged to the political option I don't actually approve in absolutely any way. And I cancel the whole fucking thing. I don't want, I didn't want, I refuse to have anything to do with these people. That's all the rest of it. Okay? So, basically, I don't know if there is anything else here I would add to this. Uh, At no surprise was the Czech girl. 15 years, I don't know. That's all I can tell you. Uh, I don't have the hard drive. I due to collateral here you can see this the only thing left at that point in time i had 18.4 gigabytes but it was much worse i already got even to 16 gigabytes later and i said that's when i said fuck this these people are gonna try to exhaust me completely and what's gonna happen is it's gonna be exactly according to their mk ultra predictions and the only thing that's gonna happen is i'm gonna end up without basically without a hard drive and uh, but that's not exactly what I want you know 18.4 gig 16 gig that's when I decided I'm gonna delete all the images videos everything and go back to 50 get this videos videos as you see right now done and move forward with the stuff because there's so much stuff that I have to still put online that I can actually even function because their ultimate revenge on me was to actually block me from having even the ability to operate my laptop due to hard drive failure. That's pretty damn evil, I would say. What is going on with this here? This is, this is what's known as my wallet. Um, along the way, I was required to install some kind of program known as My Wallet, but this is Slovenian version of My Wallet, which dictates for online purchase from this particular store, Big Bang. Uh, I, I, I don't, I am all fucking confused about that stuff because for the eBay, it's enough to confirm, um, it's known as a, 
has a code that's sent to your phone, right? To your smartphone. You entered, you entered the number that is sent for the, uh, in respect to the certain transaction. Uh, you enter one in, in, in a window if that's what you gotta do. Uh, and the system confirms that that's you and the, the, the transaction is processed after you entered your debit card, credit card, or whatever it is. Okay. That's where you buy from AliExpress or from eBay, right? If you already have to do this. Okay. But in Slovenia, that's in Slovenia, do it. And this card is from Slovenia, this debit card. They required me to install a special program on my Android. That's a special program that actually looks like this. For this transaction, so that me. I could have a you can submit possible transaction. There is still gonna this yuck that you're not there is something. Yeah, you, you can see me that I'm not happy with this stuff. Security right? feature on your yeah, this is about my telephone being completely hacked. Bluetooth would keep coming up without my turning one on. I told you about other problems. I realized that uh, Google Play is a matter of imposs impossibility to disconnect one. Even if you turn off all the access that Google Play has to, uh, once you reboot the phone, it comes back. You cannot turn the fucking thing off. You cannot stop one. You cannot turn one. You can do nothing on these phones because they're hacked like this. I don't want to look like a top-notch idiot, but everything in life, every step you do, everything you fucking do is evolving your own issues, crazy issues, completely insane shit that if you would do to one person one stuff like this, it would be already insane. But in this case, everything is just done like this. And so I was told that police is going to do this shit to me by the police. How are we going to fuck you? You're going to... You're not going to be able to prove because we're going to force you to put the lock on your phone. You're not going to have a lock on your phone, but we're going to make you to put the lock on your phone. Do it. Uh, the lock on the phone wouldn't help shit because this shit is done in a such a way that they have access to the stuff you don't. Okay. Uh, this is done through connecting you to the certain address. It could be done through God knows how you go to the website and the telephone downloads the shit and they can do with you whatever they want. And the best is when you leave the fucking phone at home because your mother is breaking your balls that she is late to the store to buy eggs. And it's entitled to all that kind of domestic abuse shit and so on and so forth and you leave the stuff behind and you rush just to observe yourself that you were fucked and actually intentionally because you get laughed in the face afterwards no 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 uh, these people use people that hack phones this this is not somebody that that that's whatever they know how to bridge the security stuff on the phone, even if you have one, whatever, it doesn't make sense. The only thing you can do is you can make your self things easier, basically. But within that hour, two, or maybe three or four, that whatever the mom is going to need so that your phone, which you left at home, can be broken in, uh, is not going to save your ass, one way or the other. They get access and they get installed themselves, whatever the fuck they want. So, this program, for the first time I used one, but to purchase through this company, Big Bang, through Milan Kuchan Company, you are required to do this. You are required to install this kind of program to complete the transaction. And you have to type 
click yes I want this transaction to be processed and then it's okay then your bank will process this transaction and I did it I did it and then I removed the fucking thing from my phone because I never used that shit for any other transaction in my lifetime I think at least and I don't want that shit to condition me security features on my phone because I already know what I have the phone for what I use one and I don't need to put stuff that I don't need so that police can claim that the phone was protected and stuff like this and, and so on and so forth. I don't need to do this shit. Police did all kinds of stuff to make me feel insecure about myself. Uh, they, they had me collect during visit to father gloves, uh, put the gloves inside of the uh, backpack whatever uh, police officer entered the room put the fucking gloves on the table for what I was told by the German side actually will be done because police officer literally gave me a scenario on how the gloves latex gloves and stuff like this I'm gonna see the latex glove when I go inside I'm gonna see this I'm gonna see that uh, when they tell you stuff like this, they tell you stuff like this so that you would be afraid of something that somebody else planted. And that's exactly what I don't do. In the room of my father, there is a broken knife. I didn't break one. This knife has been there, there for, for many years. Now, this knife appeared right there for the first time as I sleep in that room, right next to the bed on a table. That, I was told by the police officers, is going to demonstrate me when I see it, that something is wrong with you mentally, that you suffer from whatever, and stuff like this. Well, don't worry, the knife is still there, the gloves are still there. I'm not fucking, they're not fucking going anywhere. Because you just don't have what it takes. You know, your impression you made on me is like, basically the one of the worm on the field. Nobody have any fucking respect. Not fear respect, not any kind of respect for you. Because you're not a police. I know so. Because I wanted to be a police officer. I know what is expected of a police officer. You're shit. With a guy like you, you don't even know what the fuck I would do. If I only could. If it's going to be giving me a chance. You're not a police officer. It's not a police. And German stated that's going to be used to see how much uh, level of stress or whatever and that kind of stuff insecurity if you like it's all there the fucking gloves are there the knife is down there and i fucking move one anywhere whatever you do is going to be right that's going to be wait for me for you let's just continue with this stuff here the feature, security feature from the wallet is thrown out. All this shit through one fucking hard drive. Yeah, hard. that's how it's done. Edino sa dvevo, ki jaz vidim tukaj na vaši spletni strani, piše, pač iz delek je gor in potem na vrh, če iz gor v levem, na levi strani, piše na voljo v petih do sedmih dneh. Dodaj v košarico je odspade, možno za očilo v 14. dne, želite ponudba na podjetje, kontaktirajte nas, pa ali pa še dostava, pišu pa standardna dostava. A imate še kaj drugega 240 GB? Kako bi rekel, se pozanim, da je en, a lejte gospod, Yep, the order didn't go through. I requested the money back instead. This is important stuff for me to people. You greater Serbian chit or when it came to water, I'd say like a pat maybe no it was this I already have explained exactly how 
all the stuff is done it was done in respect of the trade even that involved the hard drives in this case with all other trade was done the same way the same shit the same thing uh milan kuchan had a tremendous tremendous problems this is just to finish the milan kuchan completely with what i stated he had a tremendous problems with what i stated Milan Kuchan had a, such a big problems with what I stated that Big Bank bailed himself out somehow in 2015 from what I stated. It was something with the Germans transaction, something like this. They told me it can be traced up to 2015. It was a Milan Kuchko that was doing this kind of stuff for the Big Bank. When he find out that I will have a capacity to actually trace them, he went ballistic. And as a matter of fact, I think that Big Bank could not, I was even warned by some politicians in Slovenia, I remember now. But the last stated me something about that stuff. That he will be, it could be that he will, be, they're not going to be able to deny it up to like 2015 or something like this. So this shit went on with the 2013, 2015. And then I don't know about the rest of the stuff in respect to 2000, 2017 when it comes to Big Bang and so on. But it was other companies that continue with that. And it's a possibility that Big Bang still got himself in even in 2017. Milan Kuchan, he was esteemed that went out of his ears and nose because they realized that there is actually a fucking possibility in the universe that I could come up with something I demonstrated you in this video. Actually stated on this video. What I'm going to do is, because of this low resolution, because I know that you are not capable to see absolutely everything here, I'm going to make like a, like a short video out of like little excerpts that I'm going to do due to lack of memory on this laptop. This laptop was sold to me as a 8 gig uh, RAM, but it's really, really not. It's got like way less and I didn't know any any better I didn't know about how to how to actually see this beyond this here it says here RAM 8 gigabyte but it's actually 2.64 usable I don't know if you guys understand this stuff uh, I do not I, I don't know how is this stuff um but that's a problem that I'm facing with a Windows Movie Maker. So I cannot go and burn everything on one. Do you understand me now where I am coming from? Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to whatever transactions, whatever is important, like highlights, uh, how it was returned this back and forth. Uh, of the package uh, the, the audio also I'm actually going to even prove maybe to you what I stated was a phone call uh, like between one hour when I call and nothing nobody would call me I would be calling other companies and doing stuff and then all of a sudden bam when I call the lady calls after one one hour exactly they don't answer the phone, but the phone rings and it's the lady. This shit happened to me on many occasions, on many other occasions with other stuff. Uh, but nothing really recently for many, many years. So that's all I want to say for this video. Um, yeah, it's not difficult to deliver to the main office located in the center of the city for the company like a DPD, it shouldn't be a problem and really there is some stuff that was done in respect to this company when I called that they did not answer even the phone and, and that's the kind of stuff you're going to hear see on a separate video that's going to also blow your mind out so I'm having a pain in my throat I think I'm having for the COVID second COVID problem or something like this um, and it's going to be a tough one again. Still, I did video recorded this video. And there you have another proof about Slovenian postal services. Uh, and this one is actually 
ranging all the way to Slovenian government, all the way to completely other issues that were involved in this crime. <sighs> Call this shit whatever you want, but I was I was as on topic as I possibly could be, so that you can see how far what they can do to the human being, basically, in the name of whatever you want to, you know, in the name of whatever you want to call this. Uh, what's left for me is to take a date and time, which you see right there is displayed as Sunday, December the 4th, 2022, 127. Still, that's something I'm going to go ahead and get confirmed through here. Um, the guys that I have uh, the guys whom I have identified uh, as soon as I um, as soon as I noticed this stuff that for this me is this is uh, uh, important to video record but it was everything like this okay <laughs> I see that I gotta see uh, what I'm gonna Aha, uh -huh, okay. This, this, this guys are involved. This is all involved in this here. Value or trash? See, so here, avoid is no good, is no good. This is some guy from Serbia, this guy here is big guy right there. This guy yeah, was involved in something, here, so. I don't know. About this guy here. You can see here what it says. It says here, value or trash. And then another guy who also was involved in this was a German guy. I recognize his voice. Actually, not so much of the voice. No, 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 no. But the way he talks. Because he told me that the guy, that he's not appealing, that he's got extra kilos. He have a very low self-esteem. But that he had in the German language a very, very nice way to, uh, to explain stuff. And sure enough, that's going to do for him to get the girlfriend, whatever. Yeah, he was dreaming about getting himself a girlfriend. Quite a funny guy, anyways. And he was a very, very IT bustler, yeah. <laughs> but he was very, he knew uh, very properly to, he was very proud about knowing how to properly It could be probably this one here. Softly explain his issues. Well, it's not. You're talking about some... <laughs> German guy here, as I IT said. IT Bastler, right there. IT Bastler, oh, there that's go. the one. This guy here. This guy was Hello, involved. He's got a really, if you understand German, he's got a really, really fine way, nice way to, to la 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 la. This guy told me, oh, it's going to be shit, it's going to be no good, and so on and so forth. And then it was... Uh, no, this I guy, if you doubt, did I remember him? He's got quite this a few extra here, kilos. Who swears himself on this Patriot company of the hard drive as good as the best. I don't know what the fuck. The, the very good, very, very good. I didn't go over to Svako see the people. Prati, not the good. Svako koga prati, yes, indeed. No good. Only this model is no good. Which I, I am him, actually it, quite thankful to the guy that he did post that stuff. It's okay. I don't mind. Good, very good review he did. Garbage is going to do that. Was involved in Antioch, but I refuse to have anything to do with him. There you go. This is the one you should buy. This is the one you should buy. Yeah. And this was presented to me under MK Ultra. We tested the hard drives. No good, no good. How about you? No good, no good. 
Yeah, they brought the people involved in MK Ultra inside of the room. One, two, three, four pieces. What do you what about you? What have you learned? No good. I tested no good. This one, no good. So remember when you get this hard drive, when it appears, if you're not going to take the money back and this and that, your even your computer will be cooked because it increases the temperature. And then it was more of the bullshit. Then it was from other people also, politicians. Now he most likely will not realize. Yeah, because this, yeah, but he will see this and he will not see that. And But he will t uh, check the company, but will not check the model and stuff like this, you know. Uh, and then, yeah, and we got one good. Yeah, this one is good. The, this one is good. If you're going to order uh, this one, however, this one will be good. So there will be one that will be good. And then they demonstrate this guy and so this schizophrenia went. This, you know what this shit is? This is a schizophrenia. Just that I'm not the schizophrenic. This is a sick shit that is very criminal. It's actually beyond criminal. This should never ever happen. It's the worst crime you possibly can commit one. And in my case you destroy 28 years of life. Enjoy. You will. You will put me. You will recognize me as involved in MK Ultra. You will. And so, there you fucking have it. This is the second with the same cost hard drive with a good transmission rate. And the guy wants to be in the picture no matter fucking what. Your money, actually, my fucking money. And do you remember the top notch idiot? This stuff here? Uh, totally update my watch and I would love to hear your answer uh, basically uh, this is really not the stuff you want to do to people <laughs> take their money and fuck them up like this all over the place basically using their money to destroy them you don't uh, you don't want to do stuff like this to people if you want people to see you as a human being you don't want to do that you don't want to. You don't want to do that stuff like this to somebody, do you? Yes, because you have to fuck with the human sanity. Somebody is creating this shootings and shit, rampage shootings and stuff. Somebody is doing it. Thanks for watching this video. Um, there is nothing else to say. We did took date and time, and on top of it, you have one right here on top. Uh, till next time.